Всем привет, меня зовут Катя Клэп. Привет, я Стас Давыдов. Всем привет, меня зовут These smiling faces are now among the most popular mass media stars in Russia. Every day, millions are watching them on YouTube. At first glance, it may not look so serious. But the director of an independent news channel says social media platforms are a real alternative to television, especially for young people. Два года назад мы не могли представить, что, например, тот же YouTube канал станет нашим прямым конкурентом. И это вызов, который ты принимаешь и отвечаешь каждый день, сейчас задаешь один вопрос: а что будет через год, через два? One of the top video bloggers has collected two and a half billion views. But they're not only about entertainment, video games or goofiness. They can also touch on social or political topics. Близятся выборы и видео, где люди объясняют, что за Г партия Единая Россия, еще и доступно объясняют о такие ролики на вес золота. This video from a vlogger called Kamikaze Dead collected three million views. Young people like him don't just earn thousands of likes. There's big money from ads on their videos, which are often light-hearted, but at any moment things can turn serious. Когда вы только по честному последний раз давали взятку? Навальный только. Vlogger Yuri Dut is known for his foul-mouthed interviews. Russian opposition leader Alexei Navalny sat down with him after a short stint in jail following an anti-corruption protest. The video got more than two million views. Social media fame has also come to young opposition politician Lyubov Sobol. После того, как я начала вести э, утреннюю программу «Кактус» на канале «Навальный лайф» стали узнавать чаще, Рос сделала селфи. Russia's mainstream media has towed the Kremlin line, especially when it comes to politics. But the disappearance of most independent channels during the rule of President Vladimir Putin has led millions to look for alternatives. That's given Russia's young YouTube generation a chance to break through and break out.